फेवर्स इज सिर्फ ही मास्टर टीचर ऑफ केमिस्ट्री एट वेदन टू वेरी हैप्पी संडे सो आई होप यू गेज आर डूइंग ग्रेट ओके सो हेल इज इन ओके सो वॉट इट इज ट्राइंग टू से इज प्लीज टेक अ नोटबुक एंड अ पेन बिकॉज आई बी टेलिंग यू अबाउट द चैप्टर वाइज मार्क्स डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन एज वेल एज द वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक्स फ्रॉम ऑल द फाइव चैप्टर्स यू गेज वेरी ओके देन बिफोर दैट इफ you guys are facing any of these problems or all of these problems who wants who needs problems in their life right so let's just kick them out how all you have to do is you have to take up the pro subscription where you will get some bonuses also micro courses cash courses sub kuch so what you have to do how to get this visit the link given in the description box as well as in the pinned comment choose your grade board click on to the get subscription and use the coupon code s u r p r o so as it is diwali you will get up to 50% offer up to 10000 rupees tak offer milega so hurry hurry if you guys are thinking should i get it or should i not i guess this is the right time okay then chal chapter wise mass marks distribution for science not whole science up huh? i will tell about science also but our main focus is on chemistry okay I I see only chemical substances, nature and behavior. So total marks is twenty six. So how to get twenty six out of twenty six? Hmm. Let's do it. So this is the sample paper instruction. Please go through it. So there will be four sections: A, B, C, D. So A section it contains one mark questions, B two marks, C three marks, and D is five marks. So section one me A me hoga one to twenty questions. So thirty two marks. See here, seventeen to twenty questions. Seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. So it will have five sub parts. MCQ type hai. So you need to attempt only four out of five parts in each question. Okay. So it contains VSA, AR, and MCQ type questions. So section two may twelve marks. Total twelve marks. Thirty to fifty words. Please, time management is very very important. So for two marks only, make sure that you are not writing the whole essay. No one has asked, right? So, jitna chahiye, bas utna hi likho. Because I used to do that as a student. I'm like, I have studied all this. Let's write everything. And for five mark questions, the last part, teacher used to like, sir, we have submitted the paper. So that should not happen. So please, time management is very, very, very important. Okay? So, section C, twenty one marks, fifty to eighty words. And section D, me, you will get thirty four, thirty five, thirty six, three questions. Five marks each, so from all the three branches: biology, physics, and chemistry. Eighty to one twenty words. But of course, our main focus is on chemistry. So section A, B, and C. So here in section A, so four questions will be from chemistry. The question type will be VSA, MCQ, as well as AR, assertion and reasoning. Okay, so it will have four parts each, as I told you. You have to. Four questions will be from chemistry, and section two may two questions. So there will be total six questions, two questions from chemistry, and in section three, three, and in section one, section D, one question from chemistry, five marks ka hoga. So total number of questions will be four plus four one nine eleven fourteen fifteen hoga na fifteen questions fourteen to fifteen questions from chemistry. Okay, now talking about chapter-wise marks distribution. See, the thing is, as you know, there has been reduction in the syllabus, metals and non-metals. So extraction, pure extraction part has been re reduced, and in carbon compounds, we only twenty to thirty percent is left, right? So they have removed everything. So obviously, uh, there will be few confusion because if we refer to the previous question paper. so they have focused see in carbon and its compounds nomenclature is very important and uh, um, metals and non metals may extraction corrosion and rancidity so those are important but now so the importance might be given on different topics so i'll tell you what are the important topics you have to focus on every chapter okay so first is chemical reactions and equations 3 to 4 marks since it's not accurate so after referring to the sample paper and the previous question paper so we have to we have come to the conclusion that acha 3 to 4 marks hoga so your focus has to be on chemical reactions and equations way see 
द डीकम्पोजिशन रिएक्शन उसमें देर आर थ्री टाइप्स राइट थर्मल फोटोकेमिकल फोटो फोटोलाइटिक डीकम्पोजिशन एंड एज वेल एज इलेक्ट्रोलाइटिक सो दो थ्री टाइप्स आर वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट एंड देन रिएक्टिविटी सीरीज ओके सो रिएक्टिविटी सीरीज and types of decomposition reaction single displacement reaction is very very important in that chapter and coming to acids bases and salts 5 to 7 marks so what are the important topics in this chapter acids bases and salts mein see first the thing is salts chlor alkali process that is important and then you know the uses of common salts how you get the substances like sodium bicarbonate and washing soda bleaching powder those are also important and the reactions neutralization reaction reaction between acid and base and reaction of acids especially acids is super important okay and metals and non metals mein extraction has been removed so what should we focus on metals and non metals the physical properties especially the exceptions because generalizing is very easy general statements general properties are very easy right ha uh, all metals are lustrous okay so which are, which are soft metals which one which is a liquid metal which is non malleable so please focus on the exceptions and metals and uh, non metals mein again the chemical reactions especially you know you have this which of the metal floats why calcium and magnesium floats So because the hydrogen atoms, the hydrogen molecule sticks to the surface of the metal, and HNO3, why uh, along with when uh, an acid reacts with HNO3, why hydrogen gas is not being evolved? Because it's a strong oxidizing agent. So there also you will have exception when you take very dilute HNO3, magnesium and manganese, they will give hydrogen gas. So these are few topics you have to focus on. Carbon and its compounds. electron dot structure is very important even in metals and non metals also electron dot structure so they will they will ask you uh, show the formation of an ionic compound nacl mgcl to cao so you should know how to write the electron dot structure electronic configuration is important and you have to show the transfer of electrons formation of ion and how the ionic compound will be formed and its properties properties of ionic compounds are also important coming to carbon and its compounds very very important is electron dot structure see because nomenclature is not there now right so electron dot structure is very 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 important so they might ask you electron dot structure of methane or electron dot structure of you know uh, sometimes you, as we are discussing about covalent compounds also they will ask how many covalent bonds are there in this compound or what kind of bonding is there between carbon atoms in this compound so you should know the difference between how, how many and the type so that a single covalent double covalent triple covalent or how many you have to count all the covalent bonds okay and even the allotropes of carbons are also very important that is graphite and diamond their physical properties and the reason why graphite is a good conductor of electricity and the structure what kind of bonding is there so that is also important and the next the last topic is the homologous series homologous series the general formula and what will be the difference in the compounds with respect to you know maybe the physical properties may there will be gradual change chemical properties will be similar why because of the same function group and when it comes to physical properties why can you see the gradual change that is because of the increase in molecular mass so those are the important topics and when it comes to periodic classification you all know trends are super important okay so they will just give you the small periodic table a b c d or you know and they will give you the group so tell me which has more um, which is most electronegative which is more electronegative which has the greater atomic size you need to compare so for all that you have to know the trends right so what happens across the period what happens to the atomic size down the group so you have to know them and coming to the early attempts of uh, uh, classification of elements so mendeleev's periodic table is very important so modern periodic table so you have to know how many groups how many periods are there everything okay there modern periodic table mein number of groups and uh, periods and the trends is super important and mendeleev's periodic table ka merits and demerits 
and the last two so that is uh, Dobereiner's triads and Newland's law of octaves may they will ask you the demerits and triads may they will ask you so these are the atomic masses of the first and third element so calculate the atomic mass of the second one so you have to know how to do it we have to just take the average right so this is the chapter wise marks distribution along with the important topics so we have covered everything as you know we have focused on all these important topics also and do not worry from the next session we'll be solving the previous year question paper too along with Minty, huh? which is your favorite so stay tuned and do not forget to subscribe to the channel if you are here for the first time and if you also want to be a topper then go and roll now 3 p.m every sunday you have the opportunity to get up to 100 percent scholarship so do not miss this is for cbsc students icac students every month okay and if you want to join our telegram group group the link is in the description and if you want to take up the pro subscription the link is also available in the description and the coupon code is s-u-r-p-r-o so that is it thank you so much i'll see you very soon till then take care bye bye